Namaste. Hey, this is Trevor Seven, December 25th, 2015, and I wanted to squeeze in one more video of the year. And my intention was actually to make this a, a little uh, bonus tips for beginners. I have a lot of uh, subscribers that haven't even moved foil or paper yet, and I, can, I know how frustrating that can be. And there's no sense in that because we can do it. And I'm going to give you some tips here over the top of this demonstration. I figured if I just did a little uh, tips for beginners, you know, my seasoned practitioners and stuff aren't going to watch. So <laughs> we're doing a little demonstration with uh, some tips over the top of it. So here's the deal. Uh, a lot of this learning telekinesis isn't so much of learning a craft. It's learning more about yourself and how to control your, your empathy and your, your thoughts and your energy. And if you don't do energy work and you don't meditate, you know, and if you're in this typical, you know, American diet and lifestyle of total stimulation and indoctrination and, and work and, you know, and all this, you know, you just don't really have a chance to get to know who you are. So I'm going to give you some little cheating ways that I work on people who have this, uh, you know, curse of being overstimulated and no time for themselves. Um, there's a little trick I've learned that's helped a lot of people learn and the trick is to make a side wheel, uh, preferably aluminum foil, you know, about three three inches by two inches and fold it in half long ways just like the, the foil that's in part one, uh, my tutorial part one. And then I prefer a needle, but if you can't come up with a needle, find something that's got a really good thin point on it because you want the least amount of resistance as possible. And uh, set this thing in your line of sight when you go to sleep. In other words, lie down in your bed and you know just start to drift off to sleep, and then open your eyes and see where your eyes are looking. And that's where you want your side wheel to sit. So when you lie down to go to sleep, um, you know just wait till you're feeling really sleepy, and then open your eyes and just look at your side wheel. And don't try to move it. Um, just look at it, and you'll notice maybe not the first night, maybe not even the first two or three nights, but one of these nights, uh, it's going to start turning, and you'll notice that you're not trying to turn it, it's just happening, and that's kind of the way telekinesis is, it's more of letting it happen than making it happen, and at first it starts with your mind, so that's what we got to do is get your mind slowed way down to where you have no motives and you have no thoughts and no pressure, just relax as possible. And, you know, when you make a side wheel, your intentions will be perfectly clear what you want to do with that side wheel. But that's, that's my tip for beginners, is to take advantage of those slow brain waves right before you drift off to sleep. And that's helped a lot of people learn, and particularly kids who have a hard time, you know, controlling their, their thoughts. So there's a little bonus tip for you. And I want everyone to learn telekinesis. So... Um, if I come up with other things, you know, and I have trial and error, I'm blessed with being able to help a lot of people so I <laughs> get to know what works and doesn't work. So as I come up with little things, I'm always going to include tips for uh, people who are trying to learn this because that's my intention for this channel. So I hope that helps. The side wheel by your bed. And like I said, don't try or anything. Just let it happen, guys. Uh, one of these evenings as you drift off to sleep, um, your entire... Uh, outlook on reality is going to change as you start moving your side wheel uh, with no hands from <laughs> a distance. I mean, it works, guys. Trust me. Make you a side wheel, aluminum foil and a needle. Set it within your line of sight as you drift off to sleep. And note how you weren't trying when the side wheel turned. All right. I hope that's helpful. And I appreciate you guys uh, watching. This is Trevor Seven. Good day. God bless. And namaste.